what is going on people it's profit gaming 77 and we're back with red dead redemption part two this is part 28 let's not waste any time let's get right into it let's go all right let's do it y'all so where am i i think what was that guy's name rainfall i think that's who he was dealing with let's check the map let's see what's the closest we can go to Jay, and then we can go to Marston, and then we'll go to Sadie. Let's do that. Sweet Sadie, that is. In case you didn't know. Come on, bub. Love you. Come on, Bubalicious. Let's go. How you doing, my horsey, horsey, horsey? Good boy. Come on. Yep. I know. I know. I know horsey porsey. Nice little cabin there in the woods, man. I should go in there and rob the place, but you know what? Nah, I think not. Howdy, fellas. Howdy. Hmm. My horse is the best. I'm sorry. I don't. I haven't seen a horse better than this one yet. I just have it, man. Oh, legendary animal ter territory, huh? Is that right? Well, I'm ready for it. Whatever wolf want to jump out at me. And try to play these dumb games. Bring it on, baby. So I know you know what time it is. He look like he's dead anyway. I know. I know. I know. Idiot. What? Okay. Whatever. Man, I'm trying to get to 50%. I'm not even at 50% of the way through the game. It's crazy. It is what it is. I know. I know, bub. I know, bubby. I know. Yeah, move it, punk. <laughs> I like his attitude. I love it. Come on, Bubba. There you go. There you go, boy. Who's a good boy? Wait, what? I'm so confused. All right, there we go. All right, fellas. This guy better get out the way. Get out the way, man. Dude, don't make me clap you son you wouldn't want that for yourself would you I thought so come on bub wow look at the landscape it's beautiful it's amazing yeah yeah them chumps got bloodied up down here remember that last episode I just I put I beat the brakes off them stews with my shotgun them boys got their heads blown off, man. That shotgun really does does um, the damage, man. What the hell is going on over here? Right, you know what? I don't even want to know. Y'all do y'all thing. Who's this? Howdy there, stranger. Hey, bud. Hold up. Hey, that's a nice looking horse you have there. Okay. Hold on a minute now. We're talking to you. Who's we? Hold up, hold up. I know this my game. Yeah, I thought so, man. Cause right, I, no no harm I was gonna blow him up. Try to take my horse. <laughs> you must be out of your goddamn mind, sir. I am not the one. This horse ain't going nowhere. You understand that? What a bum. Nah, I can't leave my horse on the tracks. Mr. Marston. What's up? Arthur. What's up, big dog? Nervous? But I've been nervous for a while. I had a lot of time to think in that jail, and I feel like I just don't know Dutch no more. You ain't the only one. And this plan to get us out, it just feels... I don't know. Like he's stringing us along, I know. Yeah, Dutch is dumb. You didn't know that? <sighs> Killing in cold blood, revenge... 
We all do bad things, but he seems to enjoy it now. It's like he just wants to create more enemies, more chaos. Yeah, I know. I mean, I love Dutch. He saved me a long time ago. Mm -hmm. Dangerous. I feel like in San Denis, when I got arrested, mm -hmm. maybe he could have done something. I feel like you should take your woman and child and get lost. Do you? Mm -hmm. What reason you got to stick around at this point? It's done. I don't see no way out of any of this. What about loyalty? That's long been broken. Mm -hmm. But what are you gonna do? I gotta see this through. Try and make some of it right. There was a code we had. Gotta still mean something. Sure. Mm -hmm. I know, but... Listen to me. When the time comes, you gotta run and don't look back. Mm -hmm. This is over. And now? Now we gotta... Help Dutch give the army one final tweak on his nose. <laughs> We're breaking up like yeah. a band. Come on. It's crazy. Help me with the rest of this. It's like we're a band. We're just breaking up. Wow, man. So that thing just. Well, it looks like we finally found our calling in life. Hmm. Ride this thing out onto the bridge. Okay. There's a spot about a third of the way across where we can get down underneath to plant the charges. I've already set up the detonator. Sure. Let's get this over with. You hear about Dutch and Cornwall? Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. More enemies, more chaos. I mean, we're about to blow up the bridge for Christ's sake. Yeah, it's crazy, ain't it? Is that the bridge? Or is this the bridge? Hmm. One never knows, man. This is so bad. All right, stop. All right. Here's good. <sighs> we sure got a lot of this stuff. We'll need it. I'll climb down there. You lower the crates. All right. Let me know when you're ready. But now. Ready when you are. I'm at the bottom of the ladder here to your left. That's the spot. Lower it from there. No, more to your right. Okay. I'm ready. Come on. All right, take it slow. That's not something we want to drop. That's it. Nearly there. Okay, good. Next. Grab the other one. Pick up. It's a stick up. Wow, that's beautiful. Oh my goodness. Rockstar games, man. Some of the best. Mm -hmm. Come on, Arthur. Okay, let's go. Nice and easy. I got it. This is what I do, man. Got it. All right, come down here and help me plant this stuff. I got it. Okay. Grab yourself a bundle from the box. Okay. The bridge is wired to the detonator. We need to attach each of those bundles to the fuses. There's one on each of the main support beams. Okay. Boom. Boom, shaka laka, homie. This is a lot of work, man. <laughs> it's a lot of work. Pick up the dynamite. Come on. Come on. Let me start from the furthest. And then I'll work my way up. Back, back down, I guess. Not up. Bro, like... Can he not run? There you go. Okay. Yes. I should go get the hand cart ready. You okay to finish off down here? Yeah. Sure. Go on. I can handle the rest. Just don't blow me up, up son. It's better work. It's better work, man. It's gonna work. This is crazy. I, I'm all here blowing up bridges now, man. This is crazy. 
We're dynamite. We're terrorists at this point, right? Doesn't that make us a terrorist? Yo, Arthur, come on, man. Run. These are mine in charge. They ain't easy to come by. If they don't do the job, nothing will. Right. That's it, man. Say less, man. Train! Arthur, get up here quick! Yeah, I'm on my way. Come on. Faster, buddy, come on! Hand car? Are you kidding? Arthur! A yes, train! Yes, I see it. Come on, quick! Pump this stupid thing as hard as you can! Let's go, let's go! Just get to the end of the bridge. Oh my god. I'm trying. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> this is so dumb. What? I did my. I went fast too. What do I do? Like, am I doing this right? It says hold it, right? I know what I was doing. No problem. All right, let's blow this thing. Now I want to die. Hey, Come on. Blow it up. Let's go blow this thing up. Okay. Mr. Marstone. Come on, man. Um. Shut up. I think the line held. You want the honors? Yes. Sure. Of course I do. Nice. That's how you blow up a bridge, man. I feel bad for whatever train. Let's hope so. You really think that that'll draw attention away from us? So stupid. Tell the truth, I ain't even sure I fully understand Dutch's plan with all this. No, I don't. Like I said, John, when the time comes, you go. What about? Loyalty to, to everything. To stupidity. I've been loyal. Look what that cost. You know, all that ever mattered to me was loyalty. It was all I knew. It's all I ever believed in. Mm. Well, not anymore, John. Mm. Soon, you gotta go. Mm. Just go. Don't look back. Mm. I'll think about it. You know, I've done a lot of thinking. Look at us. Out here risking our necks and for what exactly? Hmm. For, for a silly idea. Hmm. That don't even exist. Mm -mm. How you mean? You know just what I mean. Hmm. You need cash. You got a family. Well, I need a vacation. Hmm. And Dutch. Has all the money hmm. for safekeeping. Hmm. You know something? Abigail thinks she might know where some of that money is. Well, you tell her she better make sure. And then come talk to me. And we'll find out just who and what we should be loyal to. Hmm. I like that. I don't know, Arthur. Nor do I. But I am starting to see things clearly now. Mm. And I ain't being taken for a fool no more. Mm. I like that. Arthur's get out of here. 
That's right, Arthur. <laughs> Man, Arthur Morgan, man. Shit. Catch your breath. Come on, Arthur. Get up. Come on, man. All right, get up. All right, here we go. There goes my baby. Come on. I know, I know. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, bub. Now, let's see what the next mission is, bub. Let's see what the next mission is, bub. Come on. We can go to G. Let's go to G first. Captain Monroe, man. And then, we'll go to Sweet, Sweet Sadie. My sweet, sweet Sadie. My baby. They're starting to see the light, man. I know. This is animal territory, so let's let's pull out these, man. Just in case a bear try to run down on us, you know. Because if a bear does, I'm blasting them. You all right, bud? What happened? You stub your toe or something? Well, horses don't have toes, but your hoof. Call me. Come on. This is beautiful in this area. This area is beautiful. It's incredible. Can I use weapons in this area? Why not? Why not exactly? Let me get out the horsey porcy, man. He's walking real extra slow. He's extra. Let's go into the teepee. Mr. Morgan. Hey. Hello. Here I am, as promised. Here am I. Oh, Y'all got stew up in this joint? Nice. Captain Monroe. Of course. How you doing, man? Chief's going out trying to find medications. Okay. It's quite a business. Mm. Yes. About a sick all folk. through with all of this. Well, we are, mostly. Colonel Favors seems to think the natives have broken some promise they never made. And Right. Apparently, he's punishing them by withholding vaccines sent down by the federal government. That's really? not right. I was supposed to oversee the administration of vaccines. Now, I hear the wagon's been diverted. Why would he do such a thing? <sighs> to be honest, I truly don't know. They say he didn't have a very good war, so maybe he's trying to start another one. Mm. Is that what you think? I'm trying to find out. Mm. And he knows I'm trying to find out. He'd love to provoke me almost as much as... He'd love to provoke these poor bastards. Right. Meaning, <sighs> Meaning that despite the fact that I think he's a horse's ass, mm. he knows I think that. So we're just stuck here trying to make the best of things. This is the best of things. Children dying of diseases. No. No. This is awful. Mm -mm. Where is this wagon? Where can we find it? I can show you. All right, show me. We'll be heading to a pediatric coming up through Valentine, but been diverted south instead. Come on, Captain Monroe. M Mr. Morgan. What? We must act with due caution. No, we I got shall. caution. We surely shall. Now come. Come on. Okay. I think I know a spot where we should be able to intercept it. Lead the way, Captain. Let's take this off. The captain's gonna lead the way. Let's go, Cap. Lead the way, man. So this Colonel Faber, he knows you're up here helping these people. Yes. And no. Yes and no. He knows I'm here to produce a report on the situation. I was sent down from the north after all the news of unrest in the region. Mm. But I think my presence might be making things worse. Mm. What do you mean? 
I worry he's taking some of these actions more to protect himself now. If he can incite more retaliation, maybe he can prove a stronger defense. Mm. Got a lot of sniper rifles, too. Destroying that shrine. Yes, and taking their horses. I mean, I don't know if he personally sanctioned any of this or not. Mm. This is the other problem. There's a culture now in his regiment. Mm. The rot has traveled down the trunk. Mm. Okay. Well, to the show root. me where to find this wagon, and I'll get the medicine for you. You don't need to be involved. I Thank got you, this. Mr. Morgan. But I must ask you, please be discreet. Oh, I'll be discreet. We really cannot afford more conflict. I will still be. hoping a meeting can be arranged between Rain's Falls and Colonel Faber. I'll be very discreet. I understand. So I should drop the wagon back at the reservation? Oh, no. No, no, no. You only need to commandeer the back scene. Stealing those and an army wagon will only make matters much worse. Okay. Okay. You know, Favors has many flaws, but I don't believe he's callous. More an insecure man at the end of his career trying to cling on to something that's already gone. Mm. He fought for the Union in the war, and his record was considered far from illustrious. A failed man is often the most dangerous. Mm. I like that thought. A failed man is often the most dangerous. All right. This is the spot I was thinking of. Let's cut up this way. Sure. Okay. There's a nice vantage point up at the top here. Alright. Sometimes I don't even know where these foods be going. Yeah. Okay. This 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 level design is so detailed, it's amazing. Oh okay, let's dismount here. Let's right. leave the horses back a bit. Right. We'll have a good view over the road from this lift. Ew, he's taking a shit. That's disgusting. All right, anyway. Yuck. Sick. The wagon should come along this way. Okay. You're a good man, Mr. Morgan, but I fear this task to be a fool's errand. Well, firstly, I'm a long way from a good man. Mm. Secondly, fool's errands are my favorite kind of work. Fair enough. Mm. In that case... I can see we shall be great friends. <laughs> May I ask you a question? Of course. Why don't you just tell all the folk up in Washington what kind of an idiot Colonel Favors is and save us all a lot of bother? <laughs> uh, unfortunately, the government doesn't work quite like that. If you say so. There. Think that's the wagon? All right. Get yourself out of here. Just remember to keep it clean. Understand me? Don't worry. I'm as clean as they come. All, right. all I do is clean. Oh, it's well, going to get clean. Good luck. I'll meet you back at the reservation. I'm going to keep it clean. Try not to get yourself clean, killed, man. Mr. Morgan. No, no, I, I can't promise. Come on, horse. Hurry. Come on. Go. Hiya. Yeah. We're going to that wagon, y'all. Where's the wagon? That horse had to be dead, man. I had laid that thing out so bad. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way they survived that. I'm clapping them. Look at them. There they go. I'm clapping these dudes, man. How'd the horses survive that? <laughs> Next. <laughs> oh, man. This is going to be funny. I should kill the horse first. Let's kill the horse first. 
How is the horse not dead? <laughs> good, good. <laughs> the horse is just dragging. No, he's dead. Yo, that was crazy. <laughs> I was trying to do that the whole time. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was funny. I gotta make this into a short. That was crazy. Alright, what's this? Yo, I'm gonna loot this clown, man. Hey. What you got? <laughs> the horse just like dragged <laughs> I'm sorry, man. That's just too much. Alright. Anyway. Oh boy, that was fun. That was fun. Oh, I like the hat. I'm picking that up. Yep. Thanks for the hat, fool. <laughs> Come on, give me the vaccines, man. This wagon, whatever. I don't care. That's it. Let's go. Sorry, that was funny. You gotta you gotta admit that was funny. Come on, horse. Let's go. <laughs> Look at it, a bunch of dead idiots. I love it. Where's old boy? I know he fell off the horse, man. <laughs> I know old boy fell off the horse. Where'd he go? Yo, them do. Oh, there he is. Look at this clown. That's him. Yo. <laughs> Wake up, punk. Oh, gas. 57 cents, dude, broke. <laughs> I mean, my boy is broke. Yo, that was classic. <laughs> oh, man. I love this game. <laughs> Now I gotta meet up with sweet, sweet, sweet Sadie. That boy got clapped good, man. I should have got a sniper rifle, but I was like, you know what? Eh. I should have used a shotgun, though. That would have been a lot faster. Anyway. Yo, that horse is dragged. Onto the cart. <laughs> that was brutal. Am I wrong for laughing at that? <laughs> mm -hmm. I know. I know, sweet, sweet horse. I still love you. Come on. Oh, he's losing stamina. Jeez, I didn't know. I'm sorry. Oops. There you go, pup. Oh, what else can I give the horse that would... Oops. Yeah, there we go. Hey, man. Say, dog. Yo. Captain Monroe. I've got the medicine. Oh, I got one, the power. That's great news, Mr. Morgan. That's what I do, Don't man. Don't worry. It, uh, it didn't go too bad. Well, I'll have to take your word for that. Mm -hmm. We could both swing for this. <coughs> yeah, well, I've become a little past care about hanging, Monroe. Mm. Maybe. Give me I a vaccine, Colonel man. Favors thinks he was robbed by bandits and not... Oh, no, I'm still a bandit. There ain't no doubt about that. Hmm. Of course. Well, I better get to work. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. You're welcome. Bandit or not, this was a good thing. Maybe it'll get us both killed, but it had to be done. Thanks, I hope man. So. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. What's, what's T? What is T? So T's close. I might as well just do that. 
Josiah, huh? I wanted to do um, Sweet, Sweet, Sweet Sadie. But I'll have to do that next. Or last. Or maybe next episode. Whatever. Come on. What? Boy. Let's go. Sweet, Sweet Sadie. Look at his legs. Come on. Sweet, Sweet Sadie. Sorry, that was that was brutal. All right, items, health, chewing gum, cocaine gum. What about this? Dead eye is important, man. Gotta have that. Man, I'm not gonna use one more. My weapon, I'm out of here. There we go. Sweet, sweet Sadie. Is that an eagle? Relax, eagle. Yep. Ain't nobody killing you yet. Let me draw my gun because you just never know with some of these clowns, man. Got a lot of sniper rifles, man. I don't know. I gotta clean my weapon too. Let me clean this. I haven't cleaned my weapons in so long. It's it's pitiful. I wonder if there'll be another Red Dead. I'm curious. They're probably working on it. Well, no, they got Grand Theft Auto going on, so never mind. Play with me. I got a shoddy out. You want to play that game? You will get shot off this mountain, son. This thing's still smoking? Like, I thought that was well and done with. Like, the fire done got put out long ago, and it's still, the thing's still smoking. Is that a ram? Hi, ram. neighbor nobody messing with you dog chill out come on you best leave me be ain't nobody messing with you dog you want me to mess with you you want this gat in your face man i dare wolf try to come out i dare wolf come out next stupid i'm begging a wolf act dumb the shoddy out, man. Legendary animal, huh? Who, me? I'm legendary and I'm an animal with the shotgun. Yeah. Yes. That sounds about right. This music is so calming. Love it. Howdy, neighbor. I know 
more C4C, C, don't worry. There's all types of animals running around here, that's crazy. Come on, bud. Oh, there it is. I see him. Hold up, let me go after his ass. Go after his dumb ass. Hmm. Chess over here. Getting you alive, homie. Punk beer. Lucky if I don't. Man, let's get your ass over here. I need this hide, man. Yep. Punk ass beer. Need some beer meat. Thanks, Holmes. Alright, man. We're gonna stole this one. For sure. I know it's a lot. I know. Come on, bub. Let's get back on the beaten path. Yep. All right. I know. Yep. Oh, wait. Ah! Killed the whole bear, man. Huh. I don't kill the whole bear, man. I'm G'd up for that. This looks familiar. Like that's what me and Dutch and um and and friends were. This is where we were when we after we finished that uh episode with the Pinkertons and uh, Leviticus Cornwall. Wow. up the mountain yeah is this the camp calm down. this yeah. is the camp nice so what I'll do is I'll change clothes here because I definitely need to do that I need to shave change clothes though I like this hat but let's change the coat up yeah Maybe the no. And then we'll change the vest. Yeah, let's do no vest. And then maybe the shirt. Let's do it like that, man. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Me neither. All I'm saying, something happens, we get split up, we meet there. Change the these pants, man. Right. These pants suck. How do I get new pants, man? This is cool. And the boots. Let's keep it like that. And then we'll save the outfit. What about the boots though? Maybe I can't. Maybe I got boots. I don't know. Oh wait, bandanas. No bandana. We don't need a bandana right now. No. Gloves. I definitely need gloves, man. We get dirty in these streets. So, you know. Gun belt, let's see. Yeah. Yeah, those are fire. Boots. Hmm, yeah, of course. He 
she's always a classic. Like that. All right, we good. We fresh. What's up, G? Josiah? I, um, I was, uh... Leaving again? Yes, just leaving. I'll see you soon. <coughs> Perhaps. Uh, what do you mean? Well, if I was you, I'd disappear too. This is all pretty much over. But I'll be back. No, you won't. Let's not pretend no more. Hmm. Get out of here. I'll miss you, Arthur. You've been a fine friend to me. No, no let's not get over sentimental. Hmm. Come on, the place is quiet. Get out of here. I'll go with my blessings. Thank you, Arthur. Nice. Nice. Found a friend looking for you. Oh, yeah? Mr. Morgan. What's up, Holmes? Sir. How are you? A little better. I hope so. How can I help you? Very I'm sorry to impose on you again, but I believe I've made progress brokering peace. You have? I believe so. Okay, so Colonel Favors has agreed to a meeting to discuss and maybe resolve his alleged grievances and mine. Now, he has lied to me more times than I care to remember, but maybe this time he must want peace. Why could he possibly want to humiliate us further? We got words for his kind, but they're colloquial. Uh, perhaps I could make one last request. My men are not allowed to carry arms. You want us to keep the peace? Yeah, it'll be a lot of dull talking and ceremony. Mm. But I feel with some non-tribe members present, their chances of lying or worse will be reduced. Mm. Will you, Arthur? Let's do it. I'll do it. It ain't my business, brother. No, I know. But it is mine. Okay. Do it for me? I'll do it for Charles, you. Charles, I got I've it. saved your life. Okay. Do it for me. Sure. Come on. You owe this man. You should have him do your negotiation. Let's go. Hmm. All right, so where we going, man? Look at my new style, y'all. We all get swagged up. I'm swagged up, man. But this beer stuff, man. Hold up. Let me remove this. Bring it to the camera. Hello? Anybody here? Let me drop it here for now. Hurry! I don't think we should keep them waiting. Shut up. I'll be back, man. Who's my horse? Oh, he's over there. Bill, take care of that for me, man. Move. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Stay away, Come man. Come on, we should get started. Shut up. Shut up, old man. All right. Get on the horse, man. Thank you for doing this, both of you. You have already done so much. Ain't a problem. Just hope nobody recognizes me. I've had a few run-ins with the army recently. I wish we could have done more to control the situation. Dutch should not have gotten involved. My son has a mind of his own. Too much so, in fact. Hmm. I just hope Colonel Favors can be reasoned with. I am not asking for very much. But when our people are sick and hungry, and we find our medicine and supplies are being deliberately withheld, how can we not view that as something personal? When they destroy our sacred sites, how can I convince Eagle Flies and the others that they shouldn't fight back? Maybe that's part of the reason they're doing these things. Because they want you to fight. To be able to say, look, you see how these savages behave? Perhaps. 
Thank you for helping Captain Monroe to retrieve those vaccines, Arthur. You will be at the meeting, and as one person who knows the true situation, at least, I still have hope that we can come to an agreement. Nice. Let's do it. Absolute fire. Beautiful moon. Let's brush him. I was getting close. I don't understand why they. I'm over here patting my horse and I walked over and it said mission abandoned. No, man. I'm right here. What's up, Chunks? Colonel Favors, Captain Munro, we come in peace. Hello again. Who are these two? They're uh, friends of my people. Mm. Interesting looking fellows. Mm. Yeah, they won't cause any trouble. Well, I should hope not. Listen, Mr. Um, Chief. Yes, uh, Mr. I can't say that silly name. In English, they call me Rainsfall. Yes, yes, I'm, uh, I'm sure they do. Listen, we're all Americans here, and we want an outcome. But quite frankly, quite frankly, I, I'm confused. Your men are little more than criminals, in my opinion. <laughs> Keep breaking peace treaties we've made, causing disturbances in everybody's lives. Mm -hmm. But I pride myself on being a gentleman. Really, I do. But there are limits. <laughs> so let me be very... <coughs> you okay, man? Someone. Jackson, take him away. Where was I? You're a gentleman with limits? <laughs> are you being facetious, sir? Come this way, buddy. I said, are you being facetious, Captain Monroe? No, sir, I am not. Chief Rains. That's, uh, <gasps> Rains' fault. Exactly. Chief Rains, the thing quite is, a cough. Federal government. Sure. Wait here. I'll fetch you some water. I'll, uh, I'll be fine. Thank you. Mm. No, no. You know he's going to have Monroe court-martialed. Or attempt to. He's going to make a disgrace of him. Mm. Monroe? 
Seems likable enough for a West Pointer. Why? You know what Favors is like. Because he thinks it's right. Because he thinks Monroe is a patsy. Or a spy. He's convinced he has something to do with those vaccines getting stolen. He thinks Monroe is going to force him into making a concession with the Indians. So he removes Monroe. Removes how? Favors wants him tried for treason and hanged. Why does Favors care about the Indians? Because he doesn't want to back down. I, his whole professional life. You know what they say about him. Hightail Favors. The man who missed a battle. Poor Monroe. Kind of liked him. I know. Well, still, he's kind of stuck up. Feeling better? Yeah. Come on. <coughs> Let's go. <coughs> the lands you currently occupy belong to the United States government. Why is this so confusing, sir? Why? Good day, Colonel Favors. Well, that was remarkably unproductive. <coughs> I'm afraid the federal government was quite clear, Colonel. That it wanted peace, and peace for all, and that the treaty had not been broken by anybody. Oh, is that so, sir? And did it want impudence, sir, from a junior officer in public? Was that its plan, too, sir? You insult me. You insult the regiment. Arrest this man. Arrest me? Gross insubordination. Disobeying an order. Treason. Are you mad? You had those vaccines stolen. You disrupted a negotiation. Let him... This is all getting out of hand. Right, no, it's Captain not. Monroe, let's get out of here. Aye, if aye. I were you, I'd keep my mouth shut, amigo. Hmm. I don't want to kill this man, but shall kill you. Talk to Captain Monroe. I should clap him. Now. We're getting out of here. Oh, what? Damn. I tried. I'm going to try this again. Hold on, man. These dudes is done for. Hold up, especially that little captain over there. I don't want to kill this man, but shall. You son of a bitch. Talk, Captain Monroe. Mount up now. We're getting out of here. Yep, yes we are. Time to get out of here. Come on. Get punk ass out. Don't be dumb. You won't get away with this. Open fire on. Kiss him. Yep. <laughs> What? Colonel Favors was killed? Damn right he was killed. <laughs> Alright, whatever. This way. Damn, they just skipped it. That was fire. Alright, we out. If they come at me, bro, you know what time it is. Hold on. You know what I need. Nothing less than the best. <laughs> they can shot all oh, the See ya. We well, gonna cut him down. Where's he at? Nope. I'm not holding nothing. You in that damn horse? See ya. See ya. Enjoy it. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Yeah. 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, we're not. Hold on, hold on. Fuck Let's get his ass. Let's get the ass. Hold up. No, 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 no. Let's get it. Yeah. 
damn, I have no more bullets. Get out of here. Huh. <laughs> oh, I gotta run. Uh. You're not killing me. Shotgun shells, homie. I got it. I'm looting shit, man. That's what I'm doing over here. All right, horsey. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Come on. What? Bro, every time I go to my... Bro, stop doing this. Charles is right there. He was not abandoned. Okay. All right, we're gonna do this. All right. uh, I hate when they do this. Thing. Like, why? Why you gotta do this to the boy, man? Yeah, I got no more shotgun shells. Wait, 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 wait. What? Where's my lane caster? There we go. What? I have no more bullets? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Shut up, nigga. <laughs> yeah, okay, you'll make sure what? Chief, man. I your life's in danger, man. Guess I won't be submitting my report. I wouldn't think so. Right, if you're not stupid. I mean, what report is there to submit, man? Whoa. Whoa. <coughs> Get on the train, man. Get out of here. Beat it. Captain Monroe. I fear it may be Mr. Monroe from now on. I'm sorry about your career. Here. Here's a few Here's dollars. Some money. You take it and get out of here. Start a new life somewhere. I hear Tahiti's nice. Thank mm. you. 
Just hop on a train of sand and knee, jump on a boat. Mm -hmm. We'll avoid Guam. Where? Forget about it. Hmm. Peace. Meet you back at camp. I bet. <coughs> Boy, this guy is really coughing up a storm, man. What the? Reverend? What's up, OG? Reverend. What are you doing here? Uh, you leaving? I'm leaving. Running away. Yeah? I suppose so. I'm... I'm running away. I, I tried to make... Dutch see sense, but he's very strange recently. Mm. And the women? Little Jack? You're leaving? I told them to run to. I asked them to come with me, and they wouldn't. I've changed. Mm. I'm a changed man, Arthur. Changed. I won't die over some nonsense. Spouted by a fool. Right. I ain't changed. I'm still a bad man. Mm. Maybe your path isn't changing, Arthur. Mm. My path is coming to an end, Reverend. I know, son. I know. Mm. And I know that you will face your destiny like a man. Like a warrior. Mm. Because that's what you are. Hmm. That's all I am. A fighter. A killer. And a crazy man. So be it. You lived your way. You'll die your way. But in the time that you have left, don't compromise. And you'll do everything that you have to do just fine. Hmm. We'll see. <clears throat> I don't have to see. I know you. Fight and keep fighting. Fight the good fight, man. Okay. Good luck out there. Bye. Be true to yourself, Mr. Morgan. I will. And leave the lies and the hypocrisy to fools like me. Hmm. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for tuning into this episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. So that was um, interesting to say the least. Pretty um, action packed also. So guys, stay tuned for the next episode coming soon. Thank you for tuning into this one. If you're new, man, consider hitting that subscribe button because we got more content coming just like this. All right. Peace.